Hello everyone, welcome back with FreeCAD Basic 3D Modeling for exercise number 20. First, you can click uh, Create New Drawings and change into Part Design. Click Create Body, Create Sketch. I will choose a top plan and you can click OK. In it, I will use Polyline Tools. You can click here Polyline and Create a Simple Sketch. OK, in it for a simple sketch. And then I will set for angle in this point. We set into 107. And from this point into here, set into 34. You also can change for length in this line objects. I will set into 100. And length for this line object, we can set into 110. Okay, I will use uh, this constraint to make the same for uh, these two lines and also at uh, this point. Okay. The next for this line objects, we can set for length into 46. Now you can create construction lines. I will click at this icon and the next you can click this uh, line tools to create the construction lines. Start from this point into here. Also, start from this point into this point. Use uh, polylines again. Click here. And I will draw lines. Start from this point into here. Move into this point. Okay, the next click at this point. And then click in uh, this construction line. In here. The last we can click at this point. Okay. The next we can set for distance between these two lines, I will set into 5, set again in here from this point into this uh, line object into 5, okay for uh, this line object, set into 5, the next from this point into this point is set into 5, and the last in here is set into 5. Okay, now you can uh, click uh, close and we can convert into 3D models with pet tools. You can click here pet. We can set for length into 40. Click OK. I will select at uh, this face, okay, in the bottom, bottom face. And the next you can click uh, create sketch. Use these tools to create a different edge. You can select at uh, this edge. And then I will use a polyline tools to create polyline start from this point. Move into here. Click in this uh, vertex in here. And then finish, you can click at this point. If you done, you can check for uh, dimensions. In here we can see about 107 is okay. Also at this point, 34 is okay. The next you can click close. And you can use pet tools. We extrude this uh, sketch and I will use a reverse options. The next four lengths we can set into five. Click OK. Now you can select uh, these objects and this first and we can change refine into true. You can click here, refine into true. So it will be combined. You can select at this edge. Also in here, don't forget to press counter button to select a multiple edge. And then we can use a fillet tools. Click here, fillet. Set for radius into 10. And you can click OK to apply. Okay, we done. Now we can create a circle in the center point here. You can select at this edge. The next use these tools, then to plan. And we can set for Z direction, minus 23. Click OK. So it will be move into center point. You can select this uh, dentum plane and click uh, Create Sketch. Use uh, these tools to create a reference edge. And I will create circle, start from this point. You can set radius 
in a decir call into 25 and then distance from this point into center point you can set into 20 click ok you can click close and now we can use uh, path tools to extrude these uh, circle objects you can change type into two dimensions and for length in here 45 and the second length we can set into 45 click ok to apply and next you can select this gentle plan right click and then click toggle visibility okay now we can select at this uh, edge okay, you can press ctrl mouse to select a multiple edge also at this point okay the next in here and then in the bottom here okay if you done you can click fillet tools again click here and click fillet tools you can set for radius into 10 click ok to apply this uh, fillet command the next we can create holes in here you can select up this space click uh, create sketch and use uh, reference edge create circle in here with radius i will set in 215 click ok and then close the next we can use uh, pocket tools to create holes and we can set length into 100 click ok so it will be create holes in here now i will select at uh, this edge also in here you can fill again with reduce uh, 20 fill it tools reduce uh, 20 click ok the next for the bottom here i will select up this space we create new sketch and i will use these tools to create a reference edge and then use the art tools with the three points click here okay start from this point and move into here the next you can use these tools to create uh, dimension for reduce into 20 and then distance with uh, this uh, horizontal constraint from this point into here we can set into 20 okay i will use a length command click here move again to this point so this for this constraint point and again from this point into here if you done you can click close and we can use the packet tools to subtract the objects you can set in here into 120 so it will also quite at this point Just click ok to apply the next select again at this space we create a new sketch i will use construction lines with this tool so we have uh, selected at uh, this edge the next create circle in here okay i will move to this point and also in here you can set for radius in this circle in 210 also same in here into 10 point the next in here into 10 point for distance between the objects you can set into 30 and also in here we can set into 30 okay the next for vertical distance in this point you can set into 0 and from this point into here you can set into 0 if you done you can click close and we can use the packet tools to cut the objects with length 120 click ok to apply now we already create this uh, simple 3d models for exercise number 20 with freecad software and if you have any question about this tutorial you can comment below this video